Hey, I'm Phil Gervasi, and in this super short demo video, I wanna show you how you can use Kentic to understand the traffic going over your AWS transit gateways, which as everyone knows, is one of the contributors to your overall cloud cost. So let's take a look at how we can do that in the platform. So here I'm in the Kentic map, and I'll select View Topology under AWS. And uh, this gives us the visual layout of our entire AWS environment, including our transit gateways. And I wanna look at US East, so I'll look at the details of that specific one here. And now you can see a quick breakdown of information specifically for that transit gateway. We have the details here at the top. Under that, we have some filtering options like application, TCP flags, region, packet size, whatever you need. Under that, we have metrics you can look at. Then we have our attachments broken down for us. And that's very important because that's also an element in AWS that incurs fees. What I'll do now is pivot over to Data Explorer. You could see here that when I do that, it auto-populates all the filters that the system used to generate the topology that we just saw. So here is our transit gateway traffic over time. Looking down here, we could see iSCSI, VPC name, transit gateway, a flag that tells us that this is egress traffic. That's important. We can also create a new filter right here to include or exclude anything that we want to dig into this deeper if we need to for some reason. Now, of course, we're gonna to need to edit our filter sometime. So we can do that here and, and fine tune exactly how we're parsing this data. We can also change our time range to look at this transit gateway over time or historically. If we need to change our visualization, we can do that here at the top. I'll change it to a Sankey, Sankey for this example. And when we're ready to, we can share this information with our team using a link. Here we can use an email and we can also export this as charts and tables as well.